Hello. So I'm back and I have had several requests about this design. This is my own design, very simple one. I have named it Sarabande and it is actually a one member of the Mithril family. Mithril is a design designed by Cap5898 and just after Mithril has been released um, some designers uh, designed uh, some new designs that are just one step away from uh, the Mithril and this one is <laughs> one of them. It's very simple and in this video I'm going to show you how to make it. First I want to show you the catalog card. You can see the design is very simple. It is only three rows and I will show you it is actually just two rows but I just made it more complicated than it was necessary. So we start with standard six. There is nothing special in it. We pull a band through four, picking up one and three. Then, without turning the hook around, we continue from the same side, pulling a band under the four again and picking up one and three. Again, the same. And then, you need to move actually these two loops. These two are these two here in this line and you just switch their places. And then you turn the hook around and repeat everything from the other side with the other color. What I made a little bit more difficult than it was necessary was that I could avoid writing this row number three if I made this uh, row number two like pulling the band just under these three from here not through the first one but just under the loops number two three and four and it would it would be actually the same but it doesn't matter because the result is exactly the same so now I'm going to show you how to make it using these colors green and white as in the card because I believe this color combination is the best for it. It should be two contrasting colors because you need them to uh, like complement each other so they should not be blended together but they should be visible. You should see the curves so you need the contrasting colors. All right so let's start I will start with standard 6, but I will make it already in two colors. So, on this side of the braid I will make it green, and here, when I turn it around, on this side of the braid I will make it black. Alright, so this is the standard six and I'm going to continue. I'm going to pull, I'm going to work with this side. So I'm going to pull black through four, pick up one and three and again repeat the very same uh, steps. Pull under four, pick up one and three. So I take black. I pull under four, pick up one and three, like so, and close. And then I take another black, pull under four, and pick up one and three, and close, like this. And here, all I need to do in row number three is to switch places of these two. So I put these longer loop here to the side. It should be here and it will then make these beautiful long curves on the border of the, of the plate. So this 
so here I am in the end of the sequence so I'm going back to row number one but first I need to turn the hook around so I just go to the other side I turn the hook around and from here I'm going to continue with the green so I take one green pull on the four and reclaim this is number three this is number one and close and then I take another green pull under four again and pick up number three and number one and close and here all I need to do is to switch places of these two so I take the loop number two and pull it over number one to the beginning like so and that's it then I turn the hook around and continue with the black from this side again so I take the black pull it through four like so pick up number three and one and close just keep the order then I take another black and pull it on the four again and pick up number three and one again then close and then you just need to move this loop number two here over the loop number one and that's it that's everything I will show you one more time we need to go to the other side of the braid of the hook then take the green pull through four pick up number three number one I just hope it's correct here and then again pull on the four pick up number three and number one and then close and move this one over here like so and you can see here in the center is already uh, showing this curly curly center that's it no need to keep on showing because it's very simple you can just continue with these steps until your bracelets long enough to fit your wrist all you need to do in the end is when you uh, when your bracelet is long enough just pull bend through all six loops and attach a secret you don't need to adjust it any in any way because it's simple like this so I hope you like it this is my Sarabande bracelet and I will be very happy if you tag me to your uh, renditions when you post them on the internet on Instagram I mean and of course I would be pleased if you don't forget to hashtag the keywords which is the Sarabande bracelet and Lumiela as well thank you very much for watching and see you very soon in my next tutorial